Units, all units, 1199, expedite cover code 3, Deacon Mental Hospital. 184, copy, code 3, ETA 3 minutes. Copy, 184. Sorry, detectives. I know you're just coming off a case, but I'm afraid we're gonna have to make a detour. Sounds serious. Is it a riot? A call went out just before I picked you up. Said it was multiple homicides. Half a dozen units already on scene. 131, please advise. Hey, maybe it's the ghost of that doctor who went schizo and chopped up all those patients. That's not what happened. Some patients disappeared. Some kind of scandal? Still, gives you the creeps, doesn't it? 127, 124, please respond. Joseph, you think there's a connection? It's a possibility. I believe the records were sealed. Anyone on scene, respond. Dispatch, this is Detective Castellanos in 184. What's the situation? Over. 184, be advised. Some problems with the on the Deacon Memorial. Is there any... God damn it! Jesus! <laughs> Junior Detective Kidman. Any thoughts? Nothing yet. I'm sure we'll know everything once we get there. dispatch and let them know what's happening. Joseph, Kidman, you're with me. We're gonna have a look around. Right. left in their cars. Smells like blood. All right, stay sharp. We're gonna check it out. Don't let anyone else through this door. I can be an extra set of eyes. We don't know what's happening here. You are a backup. something someone alive in here are you injured what happened here can't be real impossible I've got him. The security cameras might tell us something.
Twisting me
we cut off from everyone? Everyone must be dead. Everyone all right back there? Just a few bumps. We're fine. 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 We will be once we're fine. far away. Fine. A little further and we'll be fine. 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 Fall! Fall! Anybody there? Are we awake? Is everyone else all right? The city? Whatever are you talking about? You are the only soul here. Right now. Hospital. This place is necessary for you. You're always welcome here. I've been hospitalized. I'm afraid I cannot answer that. Please, sign in here. There is no way to ensure your future memories. This way, please. Smells like medicine. You are all right. Please relax. Please have a seat. What the hell? You mustn't fight it. This is for your own good. No! Stop! There now. You see? All better. Lady, am I going crazy? Huh? Now what makes you say that? I'll be waiting.
Whoa. Were you warning me about this? You are Leslie, right? I'm a police officer. Maybe I should help you. Should help you? Shit. How am I gonna get you to a hospital? Hospital. 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 Hospital! What the fuck? Are you guys from around here? I don't know where. Who's there? No, don't shoot! I'm not one of them. I'm a doctor. Marcelo Jimenez. You were in the ambulance before a crash, right? Yes, we're lucky to be alive. Have you seen anyone else? My patient, Leslie. I saw him running up ahead, but... But? Come this way. Quietly, mind you. Have a look for yourself. Those things chased me all the way into the village. Me too. They're all over the place. Leslie went through that gate. Good lord. There are too many to shoot our way through. One of us could try to lure them away while the other gets the gate open. You're the one with the gun. If you say so. Wait, uh, officer. You must take me with you. Detective Castellanos. Leslie should be just ahead. It is imperative that we find him. Oh, the hospice. Yes. Leslie was being treated here years ago. He'd come here thinking it was familiar and safe. You know where we are? Just ahead is the hospice my brother runs. He'll take us in. That didn't answer my question. I honestly don't know. For all I know, I'm losing my mind and you're just a delusion. But I'd like to think I still have a shred of dignity and an obligation to protect my patient. As an officer of the law, you should too. I hope his brother's not a jerk too. Shush, shush. Don't you fret. Doc, no, don't. Valerio, it's me. The good doctor is here. This is my brother, Valerio. Leslie's original doctor. Peel away. Let's expose everything. Hey, what are you doing?
Collectively losing our minds. 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 Oh God. No. Rovik. It is you. Ah! Leslie. Who the hell are you? <laughs> no. Don't follow. What the? Doctor? Leslie? Fuck. Joseph. Thank God you're okay. I don't know what I am, but it's definitely not okay. Brought me here. <coughs> Jesus, what happened? My head feels like. like. Do you hear that? We need to get out of here. Can you move? Yeah, I. Joseph! What is it with this sound? I thought it was something electronic. Feeling well, but look, let's just get out of here. There's something wrong with this place. Yeah. No, no, not that way. No. No, no, not that way. So many no. new admissions. And not a single discharge. Let go of me! Let go of me! Let go... Take care of yourself.
Kidman! Get me out of this thing! Wait a minute. It's another trap. Look. <laughs> it's much more elaborate. <laughs> Joseph, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I think you'd better get down here. Hold on, I'm coming. Look at the control panel. It's got the same kind of dials, right? Yeah, a top one and a bottom one. Set the upper dial to 22 and the lower dial to 5. <laughs> 22 on top. All right. <laughs> Joseph Kidman. It looks like the door's locked from the other side. Sebastian, maybe we can lift this enough for Kidman to go under and open it from the other side. We're counting on you. All right. We should go. I'm glad you're both all right. It's odd, though. Why would they catch you instead of just killing you? Maybe he didn't see me as a threat. He? Something startled you. Did they do something to my head? You don't look well. You should take better care of yourself. Photographs?
was that sound? Sebastian? 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 Where do you suppose we are? More like when. This architecture seems straight out of the Middle Ages. Yeah, but there's electricity. Elevators. This place can't be real. It's like jumbled up memories. here for a minute. <laughs> Is this what it was like, Seb? After the accident? Well, I never put a gun to my head. No, of course not. Just quietly sank into a bottle. We can't all be perfect. It never affected my work. But hey, you read the IA report. You know I didn't report you because I was worried about your work, Sebastian. <sighs> what else is there? We don't have time for this. I need my partner here. <clears throat> I'm counting on you. Hold on a minute. Let me climb up here and see if I can get a look ahead. You all right? Yeah. Hey, that's Kidman. Who's that she's with?
Look what I found. Seems to be in working condition. Go on ahead, I'll cover you. What is it? I dropped my glasses back there. Fuck. I'm sorry. It's not just about being unable to see. It's about feeling normal. It's all right. Let's focus on finding Kidman. Jeez, Joseph, all that for a pair of glasses. <laughs> that sounded close. Joseph, you still with me? Sebastian, you ever had the urge to just jump? When you're on a high place, or the subway rolls by? Imagine if you had that urge for a minute straight, then two minutes. You fought it off three times now, Joseph. You're learning to stop it. You're not listening. I'm not worried about stopping it, Seb. I'm worried about not wanting to stop it. Some part of me wants to turn. I don't know why, and I can't reason it away. It's deeper than that. It's like instinct. And it's getting stronger. Hold on. This might... Leslie, you're safe. Where's... Kid. Kid. Kidman? Is she here too? Kid. 
kid. Is she all right? Is she all right? All right? Stand back. I'll get it open. What the hell is going on? There's no time. I need to figure out how to reverse this if we're going to stop him. Who? This Ruvik guy? Who the hell is he? I'm sorry, I have to find this. I can't help if you leave me in the dark, Doc. And you need me to help. He will... We... We're working on a method. How can I explain this? It's... Like linking brains together. Sharing everything on an electrochemical level. Emotion, memory, perception, everything. Directly. It's unprecedented. The implications on psychology, on pharmaceuticals, on consciousness itself. Are you serious? It's a fucking nightmare. Well, I didn't say it was perfect. Especially not with such a... Unstable host. Great. So your research partner is a psychopath. And we're all inside his head. N not exactly, no. All of us are contributing on some level. But he's the only one with conscious influence. You know how he thinks. What does he want? Well, it's just a theory, but... I'd say he wants us dead. Detective Castellanos. Was that... someone else's memories? No. No. Not that way. No. <laughs> Please refrain from agitating the others.
You don't look well at all. Memories are vague things indeed. It can be easy at times for memories to be distorted by others. That is why they must be cherished. just set in motion. Is this, uh, what did you call it? Your inner sanctum? A research lab of your own. I am most impressed. Why are you back? I didn't give you permission. Come now, we're both men of science. Men of science are dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. You can show me your experiments. I can show you things. You wouldn't like them. You'd think they're gross. In science, one must do any number of things a layperson may find disgusting. I've done many things others would consider distasteful. You think I'm some kind of a monster? You concern yourself so much with your appearance, but that mind of yours, that's all that matters. That's Marcello. Is that Ruvik with him? Oh, Father. If you only knew how satisfying that look on your face is, did you actually think? If you locked me away, I would just cease to exist. Out of sight, out of mind. You did. You did. Didn't you? Oh, you were never out of my mind. I hope you're proud of yourselves. <sighs> the hospital has not received the family's usual donation this year. And why would they? Has the hospital been doing anything worthy of donation? The Victoriano family has always been a generous contributor. Where are your parents? They have gone away. When do you expect them? I came to inform you that the hospital will no longer be able to provide you with assistance. Materials. Your research will very quickly disintegrate. How dare you come into my home and threaten me? for what I'm going to do to you. Peel pristine skin. Thoughts from the mud. Ruvik?
was I led here? Hey, I think there's kids in there. <laughs> I didn't hear anything. <laughs> strength up my children I want Beatrice we have been through this The papers say were done to those people, those traps. These vermin? These microbes? They're mine to do with as I please. But you are correct. This was not mere research. I'm close to perfection. This is abhorrent. This is my will. Do you have any idea why this world is the way it is? What? Who are you? Hate. Hate. Ruvik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out! Wants to get his revenge! He wants back what he feels the world took from him. It's not like he could actually get that. <laughs> it's not like he could actually get that. This world exists as long as he does. You heard something just now?
think you are. I know who you are, Seb. I know what you crave, what you fear. Will you be able to live with yourself knowing what I'm gonna make you do? Poor little Joseph couldn't. Too bad they dragged you into this. But either way, you're mine. To do with as I please. Back here again. Doc, what the hell do you think you're doing? Trying to save us. Really? Because it looks like you're making another monster to me. I don't have time for this, Detective. Neither do I. Leslie has been here before, and made it back. He survived being linked to Ruvik, the only patient ever as far as I know. Wonderful. What does that have to do with any of this? He's our way out, Detective. Our only way back. I know you're out there. Listen to me, goddammit! Ruvik must be really pissed now. Breaking a STEM terminal? Never thought he'd go that far. Wait, Stem? Oh, he must be close if he's severing ties with the past. All he has left is his connection to the present. The full Stem in the hospital. Hospital? Beacon Mental Hospital? That's where he'll be. Waiting for him.
If somebody doesn't get there first, there'll be no way out for anyone! Get over there. Kidman! It's me! Oh, if you hadn't come along... Save it for later. There are probably more of them around. I'm so glad you're alright. Ever since the church, I... You were at the church? Yeah, Joseph and I. He's in bad shape, or at least... He was when I last saw him. What about the boy from the hospital? Leslie? I found him in a cage. He freaked and ran, though. I think we've all been seeing strange things. Have you been having any nosebleeds? Headaches? No. Why? Joseph was. It's like he was turning into one of those... things. Maybe it doesn't affect everybody. What is this? Did you shoot me? You started turning into a monster. You attacked me. I'm sorry, but you're tainted now. You might try to stop me through you. Wait, what are you talking about? Shit! Get it open. Get it open. Get it open. Leslie? Leslie, is that you? Leslie, that's good. Just a little more. What is it? Ruvik? Help, 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 help! Hey! Joseph. Thank God you're all right. How did you get here? It wasn't easy. At least I haven't had any more... Uh, episodes. I wish I could say the same. Hey, I think I might have found us some transportation.
This thing gonna run? Only one way to find out. Shit! What are you doing? Answer me. seem to be moved around an awful lot, almost as if by someone's will. So it's nearly impossible to get any sense of the geography around here. But the light, Beacon Mental Hospital, it's always in the distance. This thing you found me hooked up to, I've seen it in more than one place. Yeah, so have I. It seems like it's the same exact one, but it's hard to be sure. The thing that I've noticed is that each time I run across one, I seem to be closer to the lighthouse. It could be a coincidence, but like I said, it seems as if there is some intelligence behind it. So you figure we ought to cut to the chase and just head straight for the hospital? Exactly. Nice work, Detective. The right side looked like it led more directly toward the hospital. Joseph, no! Just get us out of here. There's an ambulance there. There might be some kind of first aid. I'll go. No, I'll do it. Don't let any of them on board. Kidman? Jesus. What could cause this much damage? Is that a subway sticking out of the ground? Yeah, but look how it's positioned. If we can get over there, we might be able to use it to get across. Let's just concentrate on getting out of here. No, don't risk it. Hold on. I think I see another way down. I'll meet you on a lower level. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out yet?
Oh, he loves tormenting others. Has to let them know he has the upper hand. Lays out the bait, gets his victim all worked up. His unholy traps. When it was happening to me, I could see what was going on. I could see it, but I couldn't turn back. I had to know. I had to know the truth, and he knew it. Detective Castellanos. Lady, level with me. Am I going crazy? If one wishes to survive, one would do well to consider who they trust. Damn it. Fuck. She's all right. What's she after? Leslie can go home? Can take the train all the way home? No, Leslie. Not today. You'll... protect me? Yes. That's my job. Good, good, good. When I get home, they'll be... surprised. understand you don't know what he'll become I do I've seen it you don't understand what Ruvik is after so tell me what is he after he's after Leslie what he needs to finish his science project don't patronize me I have orders I can't let him have this boy Leslie is the only one he can...
published my research in your name again. Did you think I wouldn't find out? And I have done you a favor. You have no credentials. You'd never appear in a reputable journal otherwise. Nobody in the world knows you even exist. Oh, but they will know. I have surpassed you in every way you can imagine. No matter. I have what I need. All that's left is the procedure. Indeed. That is why we are here. We? You wouldn't dare. You couldn't complete it without me. Precisely. to make me feel sorry for you. Nobody here at all? Ruvik? Losing our mind. Losing our minds. 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 Leslie! Losing our minds. Losing our minds. This way. Hey, wait. Where are you taking me?
This way. Come down. This way. This way. Beacon, just like Joseph said. Leslie? <laughs> Watch out for his eye. What? If you want to live, you avoid Rubik's eye. Watch out for his eye. What's that supposed to mean? You'll see. Sebastian, get away from him. Sebastian, listen to me. Stop. Your interests are the same as ours. Look, I get it. You're not just some rookie detective, and this is not just some ordinary kid. You killed Joseph and you shot me. So right at this moment, that's enough reason for me not to trust you. You're a good man. That's why I... Doesn't 
matter anymore. If you know who this kid is, if you know anything, you know why he can't be allowed to live. Bullshit. It's Ruvik. He's the one that...
created this world. You cannot keep me here. Ruvik. I'm going to finish this. Vital sign, sir. Leave that one. And those two. They're not going anywhere. No one can. Go, go! Uh, Detective, are you all right? Is there anyone else? Just give me some real fresh air.
Thank you. 